Our legal system is supposed to be about providing justice for all. Unfortunately, some people use the legal system to circumvent justice and instead serve those who can afford powerful attorneys. Lawfare is the term for the use of law as a weapon, and lawfare is conducted on a regular basis. Lawsuit abuse can destroy small businesses and individuals who can't afford to defend themselves in our costly legal system. You may be familiar with the example of the Church of Scientology, which has filed thousands of lawsuits against newspapers, magazines, government agencies, and individuals who may consider suppressive. Commenting on a lawsuit the church filed in 1955, its founder, L. Ron Hubbard, wrote, The purpose of the suit is to harass and discourage rather than win. The law can be used very easily to harass, unquote. Another example is the Freedom Foundation, based in Olympia, Washington. It launched an outreach program to go door-to-door to inform health care providers of their right to opt out of paying dues to the Service Employees International Union. What the Freedom Foundation said was entirely accurate, but because its outreach program lowered SEIU revenues, the union and its affiliates orchestrated a legal assault on the Freedom Foundation, filing three lawsuits against it almost simultaneously. As a result, the Freedom Foundation's legal team has been inundated with increasingly intimidating subpoenas, depositions, and discovery demands. Now that they've already incurred $1.4 million in legal costs because of the attack, how does the Freedom Foundation's Tom McCabe budget for the future? He said, you don't, you can't, it's impossible. The waste this causes our economy is drastic. The United States has the world's most costly legal system. Liability costs make up more of our economy than education or agriculture. So what's the solution? More than 25 states and the District of Columbia have anti-SLAPP statutes. SLAPP is short for Strategic Lawsuit Against Public Participation. Anti-SLAPP statutes have achieved significant success. Even more importantly, unlike the U.S., nearly every other Western democracy works on a loser-pays principle, which means the losing side in litigation pays the winner's attorney's fees. It's time America adopts that same principle. I'm Dr. Stephen J. Allen. Thanks for watching.